Uh, the, the Dolphins uh, released the following statement. We were made aware of the video late last night and have no tolerance for this behavior. After speaking with Chris this morning, and it was a very quick conversation, I'm sure. Uh, was, I'm sure he talked about his new script. Uh, <laughs> he, ac- he accepted full responsibility and we accepted his resignation effective immediately. Uh, but we hope he gets the help that he needs. And uh, guys, you know, you can't rehab dumb. And uh, I don't know what kind of rehab he, I don't necessarily know if he probably needs rehab. He'll go to it as sort of an excuse, I would say, for his behavior as far as his wife is concerned. Uh, Well, I mean, that stuff makes you do crazy things. And I mean, does a person's entire career need to be derailed because... Oh, but no, nice. I mean, because of that, can he go <laughs> wordplay. get help and, you know, solve his problems, get himself, you know, together? Well, and should he ha- have another opportunity at his at his life? Uh, he was using uh, the NFL for about 25 years. I think that is an excellent point. I think that there is this uh, this is a word I still don't even know if I'm using it correctly, uh, but I love saying it because it sounds so media mm. uh, Optics. Mm. What we had there was not good optics, <laughs> Daniel. Um, the fact that he's saying all these gross things on the camera and uh, to this woman that is not his wife, is that worse than the cocaine almost? like? Well, uh, yeah, we're all, we're everyone including, everyone's jumping to the idea that he is so hopelessly addicted that he can't uh, help but... Um, film himself and send it to a hooker right so, like right. uh and we yeah, she, we've all been a, there thank but, you. Uh, and we all got the help we needed but uh <laughs> you know <laughs> thoughts and prayers people uh prayers. i mean people do really stupid things and uh, not <laughs> necessarily due to an illness you know yeah just exactly the illness of stupidity so right. like i don't know uh, you what, can't what rehab he's not a, stupid he's not a politician he's a coach i mean he's he's not out in front of the cameras all the Someone time said I, mean, I, I don't know he's the new literally politics. Put himself in front of the camera. True. Uh, That's true. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. I don't know. I, the, the most publicity uh, an offensive line coach has gotten in a long time, I suppose. Joshua, I mean, can this marriage be saved? <laughs> <laughs> Between the dolphin and <laughs> you really weren't dolphin. paying attention at all. Uh, Just the blowhole, the dolphin man. <laughs> and, uh, Let me is, tell you about this dolphin. Reality even legal? <laughs> I yeah, I guess so. I mean, listen, I <clears throat> have done a lot of terrible things. This on is an ongoing theme. Yeah. Yeah. I am in yes. this big glass house over here, and I'm not gonna throw. But you have your act I've got a bunch of stones, but I probably shouldn't throw me either. I'm not going to throw them at all. I keep my hands in my pocket here. Uh, I feel sorry for women. Glass. I feel sorry for women. And wives. Because look at all the things that you're talking about today. Weinstein, Bill Clinton, this guy. Wives are just being screwed over. Well, Everywhere I'll, you look. First of all, I... You, that's Everywhere diff- you look. That's yeah. pretty difficult to argue. Um, and I would argue, I would also just say that I think that this has been happening since the time began. It's Dawn just we have time. a little Dawn of Time. Thank mm-hmm. you. We have also, a now. delightful movie. Um, I forget the voices in it, but it's great. And anyone with five or a younger kid, go see Dawn of Time. It's quite. Uh, <laughs> there but, was a five or younger kid watching this show. <laughs> <laughs> Your parents should be arrested <laughs> immediately. Yeah. I agree. Five-year-olds, not so much with the cocaine sending it to your hooker. <laughs> don't do it, kids. Keep it on your phone. You don't can, yes, don't eyes. forward. Show, like, with your other baby friends, show them. Have some fun with it. But don't put it on social media. Uh, kids, use your brain. All right? I know it's there because that little hole thing in your head where it pulsates. Your brain hasn't fully developed yet. When you're doing blow with your hooker mistress. Come on, babies. <laughs> Gonna be the last show. Babies you know? pay for the hookers, huh? How do the babies even pay for the hookers? I, I never got that. Like, Baby oh, pimps. Are they, like, We're out there, and it's like, what are they? The, the Tooth fairy formula? money. Oh, oh. Yeah. boy, that is not gonna be a quality hooker then. <laughs> I, I don't know what kind of tooth fairy money you got, but um, yeah. two bits can only get you so much. Tooth fairy money has skyrocketed. No one ever talks about this, but it is like, you know, what what did you get? Fifty cents tops, a quarter, oh. yeah. A dollar. I don't remember that. <laughs> Back that long. <laughs> God, I mean, me. we're talking fivers. We're talking ten. Really? I don't like that. What do you like do with a quarter? I don't like it either. Well, there was you could buy stuff with a quarter back in the day. No, today. 
You oh, can yeah, buy you a can't do any, But yeah, that, all right, that's a good point. Well, all right, $5 seems reasonable, but I remember a certain delightful Modern Family episode when mm-hmm. they were going in the 20s, the 50s. I think they accidentally gave her 100 and she had to learn her lesson about giving that money back. But uh, they still gave her like a 20 or $50. I was blown away by that. That's too much. I, I agree. Do you have kids? I do. And how much do they get? I, I mean, I think I think we <laughs> the tooth fairy when the tooth fairy remembers uh, and lo- looks through the tooth fairy's wife's purse <laughs> and sees what might be in it. So there might be some gum wrappers, some, <laughs> some change, <laughs> and a twenty maybe. Uh, I don't know. Uh, well, a twenty's all right. That's that's pretty good. Tooth fairy um, gave me a metro card. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, as one who's chastising me for talking to babies on this show, it's clear that you didn't want to reveal that you might be the tooth fairy. So clearly, Gus and Henry are watching this coke and gaydar heavy show. Way to go, Dad of the Year. Um, <laughs>